Hi there fans, and today we're doing puzzle art. If you don't know what puzzle art is, you're like, what is puzzle art? I am answering your question right now. Puzzle art is a, like a thing I made up a long time ago. So, I didn't, so, um, you know those things, you know those toys, and they're like puzzles, and you put them together, right? You know those, right? You put together the puzzle. You know those, right? And certainly, um, they are reusable, and you put them over and over and over again if you want to. And things can go in different ways, and everything. And I decided one day, hmm. What about I make a non-reusable puzzle on paper? So, you grab a piece of paper, draw a ton of puzzle pieces, then glue on another piece of paper, and you don't put it together once, you don't put it together once, and then it makes a cool art piece that also has a puzzle. It's pretty fun. And all you have to do is draw a puzzle piece with a picture on it with yourself. I'm not saying you've... We're thinking probably when we saw the title, like, hmm, it looks like we're repainting puzzle pieces. Nope, nope, nope. We're going to be the exact opposite. We're going to make our own puzzle. And what you mean is glue sticks, any, anything to draw with, and anything to color. I'm using my color pencil box. And by the way, this also makes music. It actually does. Actually, I see. Let me grab one. Okay. And now we're going to. Now you're like. Well, how do you draw a puzzle piece? I'll show you. On this first piece of paper, I'm going to show you how to draw a puzzle piece. Just because you guys like how to draw a puzzle piece. So basically, you go like this. Basically, how you draw a puzzle art is you draw a puzzle piece. So those are the current piece. So you go like here, and then you go up, and then you go down, and then you go down here, and then you draw this piece, and then you go up. And then, to this like me, you go, have a little space, and then you go there. Then you go like that. Then you go like that. Then you go like that. And then that is another puzzle piece. And that puzzle piece it just keeps going on and on and on. So that's how. Oh, if I almost forgot. We have to get scissors. <sighs> okay, let me get my scissors. Very quick because I completely forgot how to do it. I completely forgot I need scissors. So you always need scissors to cut the puzzle piece down. However, if I can do that, and I just forgot to do it. Right. So, okay, we go right here, like, here, I'm trying to get my kids scissors. Then all this artwork here. And, why does he always say that? I don't know. I'm here. So why does it say that? And probably made up something that has the name Aubrey. And that's me. <laughs> like the, like, like the, like the, um, a, a drawing of, like, me I made in the 3D art video. Make sure to go check out that video out as well. Okay, we got scissors now. And now, we're going to do time lapses of drawing puzzle pieces. And we'll come back when... When I am done with the time lapses.
these puzzle pieces are puzzles and you kind of might be saying um i think puzzle pieces are supposed to be exactly the same no no they're supposed to be not i don't think so because when you put together a puzzle piece you find these weird puzzle pieces you put together right i think right and I know how puzzles work because I actually built some with my friends and family. Sometimes. And I'm like, I'm not, and then you guys know, I am not the creator of puzzles. I just bought this idea. You're probably asking, um, hey, uh, have you ever done this before? Yes, I have. I have done this before. I have done puzzle art like a ton of times. Um, in my life. So, I have done this before. And just to give you a warning, if you want to do this, keep yourself from not going to read the stick. Because going between these spaces, I know they can, like, do read the stick puzzles, but they probably paint all over, all over, all over the puzzle pieces. And, I think for drawing them, I think you should do a pretty simple design. Pretty simple. So if you're a realistic drawer, a super realistic one, and you guys know, I am not a realistic drawer. From my last video, I am not a realistic drawer. I am not a, the best of realistic draw, drawing. I can sometimes try, and most of the time they're not the best. And that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So we got puzzle pieces. Am I our style is good for this one? Because I draw things pretty simple. So I'm probably gonna draw some classic simple animals that are pretty simple. So we're gonna draw something over here that's not too too elixic or too too detailed because it can get very detailed. So we're going to draw something like pretty, not too detailed, kind of like a kid's cartoon, like a simple, a super simple kid's cartoon, a super simple kid cartoon. Um, I don't know. <laughs> so now we're going to do a time lapse of me drawing the design on here, and I'm going to keep it simple because working with Drawing between these spaces, you probably want to draw something simple. So now I'll do the time one of me drawing something um, like the thing on this puzzle. Paper here.
now we're back from the time lapses, and I'm am gonna cut them out off camera because um it could be real dangerous. I'm gonna do cut them off camera, and I'm probably gonna glue them on this piece of paper on camera because you guys want to see the fun of making a puzzle and me talking. I think it'll be fun. We got um we got this we got this pet place like the pet room the owners apparently wrote hi cat hi dogs because they have three dogs so this is a window in their room they have a sun free clouds and a little window and they have a super muted um rusty blue wall and we also got two little kid dogs we got a Don Mason that doesn't have the clack to black one. Instead, it has red and orange. And red is my favorite color. And orange is my second favorite color. And I think they make a good pattern together. I think. I think they look good, good together. And we just got green and yellow. They know they look good together, but this one kind of muted because of the background and probably all the racing I did. And instead of like the clack that black and white on Macy's coat we got green and yellow and this guy is just a brown dog and we got a striped cat with a cat a cat okay like over there you see that cat pup it's like cat boys where they play on that's basically what i drew here so basically we got the d things over here like that we got that i also got the cat on top of it we got the house the ladder and two posts. And we got a scratching post where the cat scratch on. Also got the carpet. And then we got them standing on this black thing. Looks like this one's ready. It looked like they're ready to jump off. Like this one's jumping on like, wee! Are you sure you're going to land on your feet? And then this one's probably jumping on too. Wee! I, sir, I hope they land on their feet. Because if they don't, that's going to be very, 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 very bad. Very bad. Very bad. Because they're going to hurt themselves. And I don't think they want to hurt themselves. So now we're going to cut them out, all of them out, off camera. And then we're going to glue them. And we're going to come back when, I'm going to come back when they're done, when they're cut it out. And we're going to glue them onto this piece of paper. So, bye. See, I'm back when I cut, back from when I'm, when I'm done cutting. Okay, guys, and now I'm back from cutting them, and here are all the puzzle pieces we had to put together. And everyone says, start with the corner pieces. I mean, like, people who do puzzles, um, because it's easier. So start, but let's get the corner pieces out of the way. The free corners. They have to look like this. So we have to get those out of the way. Because those are the best ones. So this is apparently a corner piece. This is a corner piece? Nope. I have to have two other pieces of done. Hmm. So what is a corner piece? So I think it goes over here. I have a drainage puzzle piece, so I know how it goes. I didn't tell us, so let me just go glue this. Well, you guys would like me seeing fun and me putting together a puzzle and me talking this. It's fun to put together a puzzle with, you, with your fans. Oh, that one's dried up. Oh no. This one looks like it's the one with hair all over it. Yeah, okay. Let me get this in here. Um, let me glue this over here. Let me get this here. Okay, here we go, here we go. <laughs> um, that's a pretty big piece, we don't need that. Okay, we just did, we did, we did this, get that. Okay, there you go. That's a good piece right there. And let's just roll this back up. Stick on paper here. Okay, so we need to stick this. 
over here. Can I just stick this over here? Okay, so what's Papa P is next? It looks like there's like half of a dog right here. A half of the dog. So this is called Prince Please Follow Next. So let's get another glue stick here. These glue sticks are pretty apt. Let me get that one. So basically this dog probably feels there because it's the next house that doesn't have the picture. Because when you do little pieces, you're supposed to mess with the picture, right? That's what you're supposed to do. So let me get another glue stick here. This one's sitting in my paint bowl here. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. There we go, there we go. Got a brand new glue stick. I hope this one's nice and good for gluing stuff on. I did not know that kind of thing. Oh, it's not the best, but it's fine. Oh, I'll just glue this one. Huh, what's. Piece. It might just be the back of the paper, I think. Um, some glue got on the paper. That's not good. Okay. Let me grab that glue. That's on paper. Let me just put it here. Okay. Now we're going to have it all. Huh? I think mean, that's the last time we're going to use that one. So that's probably why I have the paintball. And then why not? Okay, now I'm going to put this little piece on here. Okay, so we're supposed to put this puzzle piece right here. It's not the perfect fit, I realize. It's not the perfect fit, but um, this is a puzzle um, paper puzzle piece, so it doesn't have to be the most perfect because these are made of paper. I don't know. I probably did cut this puzzle piece just perfect enough. That's probably what happened with this. And I probably did cut enough because. I have only put together corn feet. I don't know how. So corn feet the same exact thing. Okay, let me glue this puzzle piece on more closely. And let me glue this puzzle piece on more closely. Just for right here. Because I need to stay in place. There we go. The next puzzle piece is probably be probably we're going to follow the one with the carpet. Because if we don't, that's still not the first layer. So basically, um, the next one with carpet, it looks like this. Let me see if it matches. So if it matches, okay, it does masses. If we just put the glue right there, I think we're just going to on the paper instead of like on top of the pulse piece. I think so, but I think it's just easier for the camera, and I think it's just easier overall. And we can put some on the pulse piece, not like on the back, of course. Let me just once. So once we put it together, it's not, we're not putting it anymore. Let's put a little bit over here and a little bit over here. Okay. I don't know. We're just trying to glue a puzzle piece together. We've got this piece right here. And then we've got the glue on here. I think that masses the puzzle piece. And there we go. It doesn't. Complete mess, but okay, we got a cat post here. So basically, you're supposed to have oh, so this is the other piece of the scratchy post. That definitely goes there because that completes the picture. You see, completes the picture. You see, they're always not perfect. I always see that in my puzzle, my old puzzle art. They're always not the most perfect art. They always they fit together, so it's not the best. So, that's the best kind of puzzle to. Put together if you want a nice clean puzzle. I can puzzle it uh, uh, nice and clean. And even you have to work really hard to do that because not all of them have that. Okay, I need some brand new glue here. Let's look for a brand new glue. I will come back, back when I have some brand new glue because um, do not come back and put all these puzzles together. Okay, guys, I think I found pretty good puzzles. I mean the freezer glue. It has not even been used yet. So I think it'll go for a long time. Probably for over because these have a ton of glue sticks. This is nice and fresh. So we can just use it right now. What? Why is that glue? It's because it's fresh and it's not. Okay, there you go. 
Now we can use it like a normal glue stick. It's in the purple look because um, it's just brand new, so it doesn't have the light purple like the last ones we used to use. So, okay. It has not even been used once, and now have been used. So it looks kind of gross, but glue sticks are like that. Come on. Okay, make sure to wash your hands after you do the glue because you may get some sticky hands during this because I definitely did. Okay, let's glue this on the right way. Let's make sure this matches the picture. There we go. It definitely does. Okay, let's just glue this on. Okay, that is so cool. Look at that. That is so cool. Look. Okay, go. Now the next one. Look like this. It's the next one. I think it is a lease. Um, yeah, it looks like the next one. So let me put some more glue. After all, I did build this puzzle before, and, and I remember my, and I have a pretty good memory, so I probably remember where my puzzle pieces were. So that's why I'm like, oh, that one goes there, and that one goes there. I know all the carpet ones with the bottom ones with the carpet are on the bottom floor, so that works. So that works because all the ones in the bottom have carpet. So that's gonna help us. So we are going to pick one with the carpet on it, not anyone else. I think this is the cat house, probably. This is a pretty. It's not like the hardest puzzle. I'm like have a thousand pieces, but it has a lot of pieces still. Okay, so now we're gonna glue it on here. With all these things, I think it will stick. There we go. And if we see right here, that's the next piece, definitely. Look at that. That definitely masses the picture right there. Oh, that's safety. So this piece is going to go next. I was wrong. So basically, another piece is going next. He's with the carpet here. So let's see what he has the carpet. Because it has no piece. Let's see which piece has the carpet here. The carpet. The carpet, the carpet, the carpet. Maybe you didn't move it enough. Go in. Because I don't see any more pieces of the carpet. Or do I? Nope, don't see any. So these are the last two pieces for the carpet. My bed doesn't have. So let's just make this um, right, right out for a little bit. It because this piece is definitely not gonna mess this piece, but that's the piece of the corn piece. So, this piece, this puzzle is a little smaller than this piece, but that's fine. That's fine. It's not the puzzle pieces, don't be perfect. They're treaders, but that's fine. Let's just go glue a piece of glue on the puzzle piece. So, let's go open this glue here and let's glue the puzzle piece on. And you said, baby, you might like this because you might deem like. Gluing puzzle piece is satisfying. I know. There's people in the satisfying world. I don't know. I think that's like a lot of the world right now. A lot of people are satisfying stuff. It's not really me. I think that might be a little weird to you guys, but that's fine. Some of them right. Okay. So let me get this glue stick right here. And let me get this right here. Let me glue this on here and there we go. That's my that's the first floor. Now let's get my rest of house. So this looks like the next piece because it has like a house thing on. You see, massing the picture here. There's a ton of pictures that has the house. Okay, this is definitely like a cat tree thing, like over there. That that's what, that's what kind of I drew. You guys probably remember the picture, like, oh yeah, you're doing it correctly. I am trying to not get this too sticky, so I'm not going to test the iPad screen, because it might get real sticky, and then get on a tiny and glue me at the same time, because it'd be really hard to cut and glue. Okay, let's see for the camera. But I'm not cutting off on camera, but that must probably... Okay, there we go. This glue is doing pretty well. I'm glad we picked up this glue. Because it's going to probably last for the whole entire puzzle and more. I think glue sticks last for a pretty long time. I think. We have multiple glue sticks. 
Okay, so this puzzle is good right here. This is definitely the second one because you see the pieces mass, the door mass right there. You see the pieces mass. See, see that's the rest of the house. See here, that's the rest of the house. See, it's not the perfect picture, but you can still get the picture here. And we look for the one that has the window. When it has the window card, so that's this piece right here. And that's the next piece. So let's take our glue here. Let's glue this piece on here. Yeah. Let's do some glue here. Let's take some glue. Let's just glue a little bit on here, and then let's glue a little bit on the puzzle piece as well. Okay, there we go. Well, my hands are already have glue on them because they're sticky because we're working with glue here. Okay. Um. Okay. 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 Okay, so it does still have that kind of puzzle pieces look from the paper. There we go. That's pretty close to the puzzle piece. Give me more glue there, I think. Oh, no. Let's just go get the same things like glue. Yep, yep, it is. You know, so we need a little bit more glue right here. Yep, we do. We need time. There's more glue right there, and there we go. Now the next one, we'll be looking for the rest of the cap, the cap twice, and see, it's not. We're not looking for the cap pieces anymore. So let's look. So this piece goes a little higher up, you see, and that's where the cat is. He's on cat of the cat. He's on top of the cat tree. He's on top of it because he's a cat. Cats like to be on top of cat trees. I think that's right, right? I'd like to be on cat trees. I hope so. Because damn it, picture wouldn't make sense. But this damn it, picture might not even make sense. First of all, one is pretty realistic. It's, it's pretty makes sense. Not realistic. Because <laughs> I said keep simple. Not realistic at all. But it definitely has like a tiny bit detail. And um, it, it, it makes... It looks like something like a, like a cartoonish normal world. Except those dogs with a different color spots and that are not the Mason's different spot. Now that's a diff that now that's a whole new story. What's that? Okay. Kinda looks like it kinda like does look like a cat place where cats play. Uh clubhouse for cats? No, that's a different thing. We don't know. We're not doing the clubhouse. This is not where Mickey Mouse lives. No. This is not where Mickey Mouse lives. There would be mouses here. And I think cats actually eat mouses, so it won't work. So let me see what the next pose piece here is. It's with one with like a cat post on it. So where is that one? Right here. This is the next pose piece. You see, it completes the cat post. That's why it's the next pose little piece. You guys get it now? Because it completes the picture. That's what it does. That's what all these puzzle pieces do. They complete the picture. They basically complete the item. I think you guys all, I think I'm not, maybe. Because you guys, um, some people may know, not know what puzzles are, and some people never put together puzzles. But I have put together puzzles. I know how to put this together. And after all, I've made this before. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Okay, here we go. That's that's the next one. Okay, looks pretty cool. Okay, now we need the one with the cat. A little cat triangle. It's pretty tiny, so it's not be super hard to find. Okay, there we go. Also says dogs. So let's glue this puzzle piece on. Part might be a little long, but I think you guys are gonna have fun. 
Anyways, people. I'm entertaining you guys. I'm like, I'm not like this. That's like the same thing for the no voice video. That's why I put music on there. Okay. So let me look at this. It has like a dog on it. Um, for some reason. Oh yeah, because there's dogs. There's a ton of puzzle pieces. This is make the pet room a pet room. Makes no sense. After all, it is a pet room. This is where pets live. I built, there's pet room in our house, but I built my own pet room when I built my Minecraft house. But you guys have not seen it, then because I can't play Minecraft on this channel yet, so I don't know how to. Okay, so that's a pretty good puzzle piece right there. Okay, there's a cat ear. That's cat is finished with the cat ear now. And now we got the dog one. And this piece looks like the top of the puzzle. So, oh yeah, okay. It says hi. That's definitely, definitely, definitely the part there. Actually, it's the last one, yeah. Doesn't it have the board around it? Maybe it also it's cut off. I don't know. Doesn't make sense, but it's fine because it's just art. Art doesn't have to make sense, right? Art is just for fun. It doesn't have to make sense for real life. Because if it did, <laughs> my art will probably not maybe even exist because I make a ton of made up things. So, if art is supposed to be super so like and you had to know everything, my even cartoon eyes, cartoon art styles would never exist, and that won't be. And some people will not like that. Okay, so let's look for the top of the cat post here. Let's look at the top of it. So, um, if I'm not mistaken, but this is part of the cat post, right? Okay, yeah, that is. So let's find the other piece that also is part of the cat post here. So let's see. Hmm. I have to have a big round thing like this. I'm looking for other pieces. Some of them this round. Some of them this ball. We we'll probably put this last. Hmm. It's pretty, pretty hard. Oh, there it is. Now it's a cat. Hmm. Okay. So let's glue this right here. Are using our glue stick. And let's glue this whole area right here. Because that's the puzzle piece we'll be gluing on next. Let's just glue this spot. And let's glue both of you at the same time. I know this might not be like. Hey, why are you doing this? Maybe some of you guys saying that, but it's fine. It's be fine. It'll be fine, guys. It'll be fine. Fine. Okay, I'll still glue this part right here. I know we're like putting the. You guys are putting puzzle pieces. Okay, there we go. So basically, I'm gonna make sure this part. This so goes right here, right here. It goes right here. That's where it goes, right? Yeah, that's where it goes. And it has that little thing. It also connects with this thing. It also says, yeah. "Hmm, that might be the next picture." We might. We have to figure out here. Figure out the next picture right here. That's where we're going. Heading. We're heading for this picture. So yeah. Okay, I see him. See it? It's high, like high. It's like the same picture, like high cat and high dog, but it's a little different because it's not high. It's not high. Dog is high cat. A little different. As some of the puzzle pieces might not even stick on there perfectly because it's not a perfect puzzle. It's a little wonky because it's made out of paper, and everyone might <laughs> see that when we first made it right here. Okay, I'm gonna glue this on here. Be a, this video might be a little long because the puzzle piece part, but really, you guys, this is the like the final stress. This is gonna be when I should say that after I have this puzzle done. This is super cute. Look at that. Look at that. It's so super cute. Okay, now to find like the edge of that puzzle. Okay, there it is, right here. So this is the edge of that puzzle right here. And you see the next thing is this black 
board. There's like this black board. So let's look for that black board. I think that's where the dogs, the little dogs, are standing on. So that's pretty cute. I like how I made pictures for this. So we can see where puzzle pieces go. The walls are going to be pretty hard, though. Pretty, pretty hard. Because if they're not, um, I don't know. If they're not going to be hard or not. Okay, so they're going to be hard. The only one ones. Because you might not probably want to know, like, know if it's the right piece or not. But we'll probably be playing those good. <laughs> Somewhere towards the end because we're not putting together non puzzle pieces, those little puzzle pieces yet. Okay, so there yeah, we go. That's pretty cool. It has some little glue over there, but that's fine. It's got a little purple, but <laughs> in some place, but that's fine. Look at that. Look at that. That's real pretty cool. Now let's go for this. This looks like a puzzle piece of the same one for the dog, high dog poster. It looks like the ace is like cut in half or something like that. It doesn't really put it together, but that's fine. We'll just be okay with that. You guys can be okay. Don't be sensitive to be like, hey, hey, um, that, that piece is, um, the ace is not finished. I know. It's fine. It's fine, guys. It's be fine. And I don't see, I don't see. I only see three pieces, so the black one be three pieces. So these dog might be must be pretty small if they only take three pieces here. Okay, let me let me see here. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, so we're supposed to glue on here. So I didn't get a ton of glue. So let me take the glue again and let me glue that more down. Because if we don't do that, it might come up and may break apart, and that would be fun if <laughs> they spill all over again, right? And there. There we go. Puzzle piece completed. That's no, no the puzzle's not even completed. Close to completed. We still have a ton of puzzle left. Okay. So let's see. Oh, the and the dog has this little dog on it. So let's just see. Oh yeah, it has a little dog's on it. I was right. I got the little dog thing. Do you see? He has a little smart Arby now. Why do they call him smart? You don't want me That's wrong. I do like math. Even though most kids don't like math. Okay, let me just glue this on here. Okay, let me just make this make sense. It's gonna have little holes in it, but that's fine. It's gonna have some holes in it, but that's fine. There we go. That's gonna make sense, though. That's because it's supposed to be. Awesome. Let's go. Let's. Right here. Okay. Now we're the. Now I found this other dog. I think it connects to the same pick, the same board. Yep, it definitely does. So let's glue them on there. Let's glue them on there. Let's glue them on there. Here we go, and wow, okay. Take pretty long here. Okay, there we go. Let's just go take the glue on right here. And let's take it right here. And let's glue this. Let's be on a tiny bit more, like a tiny bit. There we go. That looks pretty cool. This puzzle piece is turning, this puzzle's turning out pretty well so far. My hands are getting super sticky, but it's turning out pretty well here. Pretty well. Okay, let's find the last part of this thing. Okay, right here. Right here is the last part of this puzzle piece. Right here. We can see that because we can see the black. The black little bar. I think that's like x-ray bar. But I don't think anyone can reach it because it's too high up. And also there's a painting underneath it, so how do people reach it, right? But I guess no one can reach it, but I guess it's only for the dogs and cats. 
They could definitely be coming on with the cat post. So that means the dog's kind of cat post. Does that even make sense? No. But, can picture, the picture need to make sense? No. And they don't. They just need to be fun. And after all, probably there's so many puzzles that don't have pictures that don't make sense. Okay, it goes on here. And here we go. And here we go. There we go. And then we got. We got this mess to cover right here. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Here. Okay, let me just see right here. Um, there's a sun right here. It's a metacorder piece. And you see, there's the things on top. So let me see. Um, these are flat ones here. Can you see these divine right here? Okay. All right, now we're on to some of the wall pieces. So this is going to be a little tougher than, um, okay, so I think it goes over there. I think I need my memory on this one because, because if I don't, um, it's going to be a disaster. Huh. We're almost done with the puzzle. And it's so close right here. Okay. This video might be a little longer than normal. One of you guys, but that's fine. You guys will still enjoy it, right? It won't be twelve hours long. I promise that. That will not. That it does it's not gonna take me twelve hours to build this puzzle piece. Okay, just glue them on. No, no, that's not gonna be possible. It's not taking twelve hours. It's not. I don't think it's gonna even take me days. I think it's gonna take at least one day to like at least not even one day. It's probably gonna take me less than a day. Maybe like 30 minutes to clear it, to complete it. It probably is 30 minutes. I've probably been working on the puzzle for 30 minutes right now. Okay, guys, let me see right here. Okay, let me glue this on. Here's the wall. Here's the wall. The wall don't matter if they don't glue or not because it's just a wall. It's not like a picture. Okay, now we're going to. Glue the wall right here. It looks like the right wall. Yep, it does. Okay. So now we're gonna glue this wall here. I don't know what is coming next. It looks like a ton of wall. Yeah, because it looks like the whole place is a wall. So I didn't put any pictures there except the window. I'm gonna see what's next out of this one. Probably the window is gonna be next. Because the window is probably the next picture. And then we're gonna work on the wall ones. And those will be pretty hard. Pretty, pretty hard. It's not a perfect puzzle, but again, it's not perfect because it's made out of paper. Everyone probably expects that, like, oh, it's not even paper. Look at that. That's super cool, all right? Okay, so now we got this picture. Okay, so this picture goes probably down. Now, where did it go? Okay. This picture goes somewhere? Okay, so basically, I think this picture goes over here because it has a flat top right here. So I think it goes here, and the, and the windows be, be pretty big, I think. I know it's by my memory. This is probably pretty big. That's just by my memory here. So this is glue on here. Okay, there we go. There we go. Um, whew. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, so here we go, here we go, here we go. And now we're going to get the sun right here, the sun right here. The sun is here. The sun is shining in the window, and the walls are still rusty and dirty. I guess it's a pretty old house. I guess they brought a pretty old house. It's like from the Roman times, the Egyptian times. The dinosaurs times? No, that's too long ago. <laughs> I don't think they even built houses back then. <laughs> I think they pit, hang the picture. It looks like someone drew those pictures. So probably the owner like drew them. Hi, cat, hi, dog. So the dogs can feel like they're saying hi, even that they're on vacation or something like that. They're not in the room, so they're, maybe they're is on vacation right now. Or they're just in that part of the house, doing school. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Mm 
Okay, there we go. So there we go. So let's just get this on here. And now we're going to do some other more things. Now we're going to glue on our piece of puzzle piece on. No, no, that's not so, so let's just see how it is. So this puzzle piece is not the last one, but it probably is the bottom one because look at that. That's going to make no sense. To this one. So we got these puzzle pieces that fans out the window. And then we got two wall pieces. I don't know how this puzzle piece. Okay, so what's this? Okay, so it has these puzzle pieces right here. So they're probably going to make sense with the way I put it. Because every single cloud makes uh, has every single part of the window. So probably that's going to be it. If this is not perfect, if I'm, I'm not sure because I don't think this is going to be a perfect puzzle. I'm not going to put together perfect on the paper, I don't think. So I spent all my like lifetime cutting it, and I'm not going to do that, of course. Of course I'm not going to do that. Because how am I supposed to video then? So... So I'm not gonna spend my whole lifetime cutting these pieces because that would not be fun. And also, I don't want to do many things. Okay, so let's put this together here. Okay, when we put this together here, our mail of childhood, and it'll take years to post that video. Then, and you guys would just get bored because I've just been working on the video, and now it will be fun for you guys. So, nope. If I spend a whole lifetime, I'm probably be on this when the video is posted, so when the video is in recording, so I'm definitely not going to do that. So, this is the best I can do. Okay, this video is definitely a little longer than I expected. I thought this would be long, as long as I thought it would be. It's not, this is not, <laughs> this is just a normal video, it's not even, um, Call again. It's not like No. This is a normal video. Normal. Even that. It's so long. I know it's like it's so long. Or it's mine. Or. The ones I lost. Probably. This is not me 12 hours. I just know that. So, what? So, it looks like we're on the pieces where we're gonna face some trouble because we're on the wall ones. And guess what? When you put together a wall, um, you don't know what the wall pieces, you don't really know if they're right puzzle pieces. There's no pictures on it, there's absolutely nothing on it except a wall. So, it's gonna be kind of hard. Like, with a window, you know where that is. Like, if you put together a window, you know. How to put that together. But if you're putting together a wall, you probably don't know where that is. You probably don't even know what that is. So you need to figure out where, 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 where is a wall. Okay. I don't know what's happening in this picture. Maybe I should explain. Um. People spend hours painting. So, am I spending hours puzzle? Probably not. So, you guys just get bored already. And I'll probably. I wouldn't do. I didn't know it would be taking this long. It could be taking time long. So, it was taking hours long. Because this whole drawing probably took hours. And the cutting took like. Probably like three hours. So, um. Yeah. I definitely cut that out. Because I'm not cutting on camera. I'm going to get my fingers cut. And I'm going to like get it cut, and I don't want that. No, no, I'm not putting my, I'm not putting my, my myself in a dangerous situation here. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm just a kid. I don't want to cut myself. Even that kid to maybe hurt himself because I do. I think it's the worst part. But I don't want to cut myself. And that would be 
recording. And then you guys are really saying like, you had cut on camera before. I have cut on camera before, but <laughs> um, I have, I have, I have. But they were not with like paper, never, ever with paper. Okay, so this thing's gonna be a little on it to get this thing because I didn't cut it right, but that's fine. Okay, that's like that. So we have two puzzle pieces left, you guys. Two puzzle pieces. And this took more for a minute to put this together. So let's just glue these all at the same time because we are in the final stretch. It's the final countdown of the puzzle here. So let's get this. These puzzle pieces glued. And the, the wall ones. I'm glad I say the wall ones for last. For the, for the wall ones. So they're going to be walls only. So they're going to be a little hard to put together. But I think we're going to find them out. Maybe, maybe next time I do puzzle work, maybe I should put a, like a whole... Maybe I should put something with more pictures and more detail since I know it's, know what it's going to look like. So, the two final pieces. Dun, 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 my puzzle that was that took me more than 30 minutes that looks pretty cool we got the dog so i'll explain we got the brown dog looking at the cat we got the cat looking at the brown dog we also got the little cat tree we got the cat post because cats like the scratching we got hi cat like the owner wrote and hi dogs like the owner wrote and then we got these two dogs and they're both jump off and I hope they land their feet. There's a window because it's daytime and the kids are at school learning. So that's my little story made up for this picture. So, very quick. So, saying bye. So, make sure you leave a video like. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to ring the bell. Bye, super fans. Hope you enjoy. I hope you guys like this puzzle art I made.